This gentleman was going 123. Dash-mounted radar systems are used by police forces right across Canada to catch speeding drivers, and the machines are checked for accuracy before every shift. Some police forces, such as Ontario Provincial Police, rely on the radar's internal test to make sure it's working properly. In fact, we discovered that over the past 10 years, the OPP and some other municipal forces have stopped using these tuning forks as an additional test. They say the radar manufacturers assured them this is obsolete. This is not a required test. The, the circuitry and the electronics inside the radar already give a far more accurate reading and a far more accurate test. <laughs> no, uh, no, they're not on the cutting edge for removing that. Uh, they're on the sloppy side, in my opinion. Donald Sawicki is a radar expert who says the tuning forks may seem low tech, but they're necessary. My reaction would be to question the, the validity of the speeding ticket. And he's not the only one who thinks so. A Canadian study on radar insists that in spite of some manufacturers saying the tuning fork is not necessary, this is absolutely false. And some other police forces we contacted, including the RCMP, still require the tuning fork test before every shift. For Toronto lawyer Daniel Baker, that means two things. Canadian police need to agree on one system, and any tickets issued without the test should be challenged. I think every ticket in the last 10 years should be thrown out. I honestly believe that this is a huge fraud. Interestingly, in the United States, the court still insists on the tuning fork test. And radar experts we talked to were surprised there isn't one standard in Canada. Diana Swain, CBC News, Toronto.